Alright guys, um, this is a padlock that I got while I was uh, doing the shop in the night. Um, it's a wafer lock, but uh, the mechanism is sort of similar to the laser track type thing that you would see. Um, if you can see just in there, there's a bit of warden in the keyway there. Um, you can see the wafers in the top right hand corner. Um, that's the key for it, so you can see the cuts there. Uh, but obviously it's got this uh, this part here, so you can't just stick something in there and get it the way first. You need to actually go up to the, uh, the top right hand side, which is quite fiddly. Um, but it's not too bad. If you get the feel for it. Uh, so, a single pin pick it first. Hopefully, anyway. And, uh, and then I'll rake it for you. So I'm just going to use this hook. Um, a shorter hook would be better, but I haven't made a short hook just yet. Um, I think there's five wafers in this. I actually didn't count the cuts on the key, so I'm not too sure. Fiddly getting at this, but it's not too bad. Should be nearly there because this hook's quite steep. I need to get over the, the ones that have been set, get at these ones at the back here, which is annoying. But anyway, was a bit too steep before there, but there we go. Um, we'll lock it back up and then we'll let you see it uh, being raked. Let's show you the key again. Um, the rake that I'm going to use is basically my own style city rake. Um, I'll just pop it in like that and that's it open. Um, not a very good lock, but for a fiver, I don't know what you really, what you can expect, but there we go. Um, I don't know who it's made by, there's uh, no name or anything like that, so it's just the cheapie, but um, there you go. And uh, the picks that I was using there, they're my first proper batch of homebrew ones. And uh, whenever I get the full set made, I'll be, uh, we'll be doing a wee video on those, but for now, that's that. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.